Did you know an explosion in Siberia once flattened over 800 square miles of forest, yet left no crater behind? It was the morning of June 30th, 1908, deep in the wilderness near the Tunguska River. At 7.17 a.m., witnesses saw a fireball streak across the sky. Moments later, the earth shook. A shockwave so powerful it shattered windows hundreds of miles away tore through the land. Herds of reindeer were incinerated. Trees, millions of them, were blown down like matchsticks, all pointing away from a single epicenter. Unaware they had just witnessed the largest explosion in recorded history, locals whispered that the gods had struck the earth. When scientists finally reached the site, years later, they expected to find a massive crater. But there was nothing. No impact site, no meteorite fragments. Just a desolate wasteland of scorched earth and flattened trees. So what caused it? The leading theory is that a comet or asteroid, up to 200 feet wide, exploded in mid-air with the force of 15 megatons of TNT, 1,000 times more powerful than Hiroshima. The blast occurred so high above the ground, it left no crater, only devastation. But that's not the whole story. Some witnesses claimed they saw the sky glow for days afterward, as if the atmosphere itself was on fire. Others swore they saw strange lights and heard thunder-like booms long after the event. And then, there are the theories that turned Tunguska into something far stranger. Some believe it was not a comet at all, but a failed alien craft that detonated mid-air. Others point to Nikola Tesla, who at the time was experimenting with wireless energy transmission, suggesting Tunguska was the accidental result of a weapon test gone wrong. Even today, soil samples reveal anomalies. Tiny spheres of silicate and nickel, fragments of something not entirely from Earth. And satellite surveys show that the forest regrew in unusual patterns, as if the land itself still carries scars of something unnatural. So what really happened in Tunguska? Was it an asteroid, a secret weapon, or something far beyond our understanding? All we know is this. In the emptiness of Siberia, 80 million trees still lie as silent witnesses to a blast so powerful it shook the earth, and left behind a mystery that refuses to die.